We'll bring the mini mods out. We're going to let them go around the big track. I believe our little track is just not prepared. Jaden Alvarado is the WW2. Noah Spiker is the N73. There's my nephew Cameron Smith, the 8S car. Silas Spiker will be the 73. Merrick Pipe is the 03. I believe Jimmy Cochran driving the 1X. So we'll let these mini mods run around the big track. We normally run them in the we normally run them in the infield. Bo Spiker helping getting Cameron Smith rolling. We normally run those on the infield. We were not able to get the infield prepared for these smaller divisions. So we'll take them around the big track in those mini modifieds. See Silas Spiker, the youngster, inside row number one. Jaden Alvarado, the WW2. I talked to Jaden earlier this evening. I asked him who he got his tips from. And of course, he said his father, Bubba Alvarado. And then I had to ask him a question. I had to ask him if he got any tips from Uncle Ricky. And he told me he got some tips from Uncle Ricky. Maybe Uncle Ricky's watching at home on IMCA.TV. So we'll take these drivers around. Unfortunately, not able to get that infield track prepped enough to let them race here tonight. I believe there's a few more. I know Jeff Hunter's kids have a couple of these mini modifieds as well. So potentially eight to 10 of these little mini mods on, on any given night. So we'll give these mini modifieds a few laps to run around the big track here at I-76 Speedway. Cool to see some of the up and coming drivers take a few laps around I-76 Speedway. Like I said, they would normally, you know, it's tough to see for you folks watching at home on imca.tv. We do have a smaller track in the infield. We normally run these in. And the mini mods will make the exit off the racetrack. Next time, we will have that infield track prepped, ready to go for those drivers. Wanted to give them a chance. To run around I-76 Speedway. 